We're all familiar with a bonnet, aren't we? These are the three quick and easy methods that I use to protect my hair at night whilst my hair is in this protective style. Tip number one is a bonnet. Even if you do not own one, we've all seen one. Uh-uh, no before my coffee, please. I started off with this one because it's simple, but for this hairstyle, particularly, I wouldn't recommend a bonnet because it moves around. As you can see, it's free flowing. It moves around and it can lead to strays, as you might be able to see, okay? We don't want that. We want our hair to lie flat. If our hair is in a protective style, such as cornrows or smaller braids, then a bonnet would be fine. However, this is not really gonna do the job. So this will lead on to the second one, the do-rag. So you can wear this by itself or you can wear it with the bonnet. I actually like wearing it with the bonnet to be fair because as you can see guys, with this staff, I've got my hair in the buns and they stick out. Now you can cover it with the do-rag but it's just a bit more technical. This keeps your hair laying flat and then you can go ahead for added protection and again, put on your bonnet. To make sure you tuck those ends in we do want to keep the the rest of the hair protected and laying flat okay so that's number two well that's like a bonus isn't it you've got two styles in one if you want to tuck your buns away you just cover them in like so cover them in like so you would tie up your do rag something like that right last one is your traditional head scarf and how we're gonna tie that right typical can you see that guys triangular shape and we're gonna start from the back so we're gonna put the tip of the triangle on like that and we're gonna put it forward so it's almost like a reverse do-rag okay so instead of extra material hanging at the back it's gonna be at the front tuck your hair in like so and then you just tie it up as you would do. Now what I like about the headscarf for this style is if you tie it correctly it can actually be worn outside as well into a cute style. Now I wouldn't necessarily wear it out like this myself. I think I'd have to tie it a lot better than the way I've done it now. Right, tucked it in. There you go. Yeah there you go. That's cute. Oh. <laughs> I like this one because your hair is protected at the back. Keep the hair laying down flat and you can wear it outside, I like this. Put little, little hoop earrings on and there you go. So those are the three ways you can protect your hair at night. Satin lined, satin lined, satin lined. You don't want all that moisture that we just put in our hair to be sucked out through the materials that we put on our hair. So I've shown you how to put the moisture in your hair and style it and I've also shown you how to protect your hair at night. Now why don't you head over to this video and check out how I deep condition my hair with the cholesterol deep conditioner. Alright?